Today, we will go through problems 16 to 20 of the JMC 2015. The diagram shows a square inside an equilateral triangle. What is the value of x plus y? Well, the sum of the angles in the two smaller triangles is 180 plus 180, 360 degrees. The two corner angles, angle A, angle C, are both 60 degrees because the larger triangle is equilateral. Now, the sum of angles R and S, R plus S, is 180 degrees minus 90 degrees, which is 90 degrees, because angles on a straight line sum to 180, and the angle of a corner of a square is 90 degrees. So x plus y is the sum of the angles in the two smaller triangles minus the two corner angles, angles A and angle C, minus the sum of the angles R and S, which is 360 minus 60 minus 60 minus 90, which is 150. The knave of hearts says, I stole the tarts. The knave of clubs says, the knave of hearts is lying. The knave of diamonds says, the knave of clubs is dying, lying. The knave of spades says, the knave of diamonds is lying. How many of the four knaves were telling the truth? Since the knave of clubs is calling the knave of hearts a liar, Exactly one of them is telling the truth, because what they're saying are both contradictory to each other. Either the knave of hearts is lying or he isn't. So either the knave of hearts is telling the truth and the knave of clubs is lying or the other way around. Similarly, since the knave of spades is calling the knave of diamonds a liar, exactly one of them is telling the truth. So exactly two of four knaves are telling the truth, which is letter B. Each of the fractions 2,637 divided by 18,459 and 5,274 divided by 36,918 uses the digits 1 to 9 exactly once. The first fraction simplifies to 1 over 7. What is the simplified form of the second fraction? Well, finding common factors and trying to simplify the, the, second, uh, the second fraction will require a lot of time and energy. So instead, we should always look for a trick before going down the hard way. We notice that 5,274 is twice the size of 2,637 and 36,018 is tw uh, two times 18,459. So 5,274 divided by 36,018 is the same as 2 multiplied by 2,637 divided by 2 multiplied by 18,459, which is the same as 2,637 divided by 18,459, which is a seventh, as we're told. And so the letter is B. One of the following cubes is the smallest cube that can be written as the sum of three positive cubes. Which is it? Well, the cube, the largest cube, smaller than 27, is 8. But 8 plus 8 plus 8 is 24, which is less than 27. So we know it can't be 27. Now we look at 64. 64 minus 27 minus 27 is 10. If we use a number smaller than 27, 
8, we will get something too small. If we use 27, we will get something too big. So it can't be 64. So now we look at 125. 125 minus 64 is 61. So if we use two 64s, it's going to be too big. So then we look at using 27. 61 minus 27 is 34. And um, we can't use another 27. That will be too small, uh, too small. And as we saw previously, using another 64 would give us something too big. So it can't be 125. Finally, we look at 216 and we find 125 plus 64 plus 27 is exactly 216. So that's our answer. Finally, the diagram shows a pyramid made up of 30 cubes, each measuring one by one by one meter. What is the total surface area of the whole pyramid, including its base? So here it's useful to look at this pyramid from all sides, from the four sides, from the top and from the bottom. Looking from the top, we see a square of area 16 meters squared. It doesn't matter the depth because we're just looking from the top. Same when we're looking from the bottom, we also see a square of area 16 meters squared. Looking from each side, we see the 10 faces. We don't see anything else because we're not worried about the depth. And 10 faces is the same as 10 meters squared. So because there are four sides, the total surface area is 16 meters squared plus 16 meters squared plus four multiplied by 10 meters squared, which is 72 meters squared. Thank you for watching. Please leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Feel free to drop a comment in the comments down below. Goodbye.